why we're gonna start with GoPro background. GoPro founded by Nick Woodman in 2002. The company was formerly known as Woodman Labs Incorporated Companies. The headquarter is in San Mateo, California. It is an American technology company. It manufactures action cameras and develops its own mobile apps and video editing software. GoPro enables pursuit expression, a celebration of human passion, is GoPro's vision. Next, mission. Make it easy for people to capture and share life's most meaningful experience and look good doing it. And their slogan is, be a hero. Of course, every company has issues. We identify that GoPro's issues are, first, poor market acceptance for hero for camera. Second, price polarization is a crucial trend. Vendor began building their products such as camera and numerous accessories to increase demand. Bundle packaging increased demand by offering cost effectiveness because it reduced the need to produce additional equipment. Third, increased competition from other companies such as Garmin, TomTom, Canon, JVC, Eon America, Polaroid, and Sony. Fourth, smartphone camera of a traditional camera. Young consumers were increasingly choosing smartphone camera over traditional, which means they were unlikely to purchase action camera. Fifth, many new entrants affect the price. The market experiencing rapid growth and attracted many new entrants which expected effect on lower price, high quality and more features. For SWOT analysis, the strength is the GoPro main competitive advantage which is it has a unique business model which allow it to facilitate high brand equity and crowdsourcing. For weaknesses, the main issue that face GoPro is the financial issues and the high price of GoPro is unable to sell enough the product compared to the lower price brand. The third one is the reliance on a small number of suppliers because it relies on the mid market. The opportunities of GoPro are virtual reality technology on the rise, drone market potential, the strong action camera market. The traits of GoPro are niche market. The potential saturated market for the cameras in the future. Shrinking global photographic equipment market. Based on the analysis that we had conducted, we have three recommendations that can be included for GoPro. First point is, with a celebrity endorsement, it can be new style of marketing for GoPro to promote their product through celebrities such as sports public figure Nadia Zuki, who is one of the popular athletes in the social media. In the second point, into the bargain. GoPro already has a brand name and by leverage the existing brand name to deepen the existing relationship and form new partnership will give a handy help to the company. Thus, it needs to maintain the positioning as the world's most versatile camera by doing differentiation from the current competition by offering product line for commercial need and not only in the sport need. Third recommendation is, in order to break the marketing industry, GoPro needs to hire a fresh and creative employee in marketing department or outsourcing marketing to the creative company. <laughs>